Here with Mickey and Pete heading into Sunday's Amazing Race Canada finale, can you guys believe you're one of the final three teams standing? <laughs> Not at all, man. Like, I honestly, I would have been surprised if we made it, if we were like the second team eliminated or whatever. Like, I was surprised we made it past that point. So to be in the final three is just like mind-boggling for us. What has been the secret to your success? Um, I don't know. Trying to be ourselves and stay ourselves out there. <laughs> you know, I feel like uh, I feel like the one. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's okay. I, I feel like one of the pivotal scenes uh, of this season was when you guys were not U-turned in the double U-turn mm. episode. Do you feel like that happened because the other teams didn't see you as a threat or because, oh, these guys are nice guys, we don't want to U-turn them? I think that nobody knew we were in last because we were in first, like we were ahead of the Olympians, mm -hmm. and then we took that crazy cab ride and then everybody passed us and I don't think anybody knew that we were actually in last. So, you know, because everyone knew we were a threat because we are powerful. <laughs> <laughs> now, you know, I'm, I'm looking at Natalie and Megan, they've won so many legs, like leg after leg after leg. Is there any thoughts of like perhaps aligning with Rob and Ryan just to make sure that they don't win? Um, I mean, I don't know, maybe maybe they're overachievers, you know, let somebody else win. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, no, I don't know, it's everybody's race, we're just doing our own thing, yeah. I don't know. Do you think that, that there's an advantage in that, like running your own race versus like trying to team up with another team? Because I feel like if somebody came up to you and said, hey guys, do you want to align? You'd be like, no, we're just doing our own thing. Is yeah. that an advantage? Well, the Frenchies tried to like have an alliance with us and the girls and like really it's hard to make alliances, you know what I mean? Because it's just like when it comes down to it, it's an individual race. So I think we just tried to be nice to everybody and like I think the key is like helping other teams out when you can help them out and still beat them, mm -hmm. kind of thing. So like still helping people out, but not helping them out so much that they beat you. I think we did a good job of doing that. Like we ended up helping out a lot of teams, and then a lot of people helped us in return. So it like, worked out well that way. Is there an advantage to sort of like being these guys that nobody really like, when I say not think about, it, I just mean in terms of like, you know, they're not really a big threat, you know, they're kind of like just there. Does that help you when you head into the finale? Because, you know, if I was on the race, I'd be like, oh, look at these guys. They're just there for a good time, <laughs> you know, and then all of a sudden you end up winning. Um, yeah, maybe, I guess, we kind of flew under the radar, and so everybody is really nice to us, like, nobody tried to screw us over very much, which was sweet. Yeah. And, and finally, this season, I felt like there was a stark difference between this season and the first season of The Amazing Race Canada. I felt like the teams in general really got along this season. Was that how it was when you were running from leg to leg? Like, there was no bickering, no fighting, really? Uh, for the most part, I think, like, yeah, most of the teams got along. Mm -hmm. um, there was some animosity between some of the teams. <laughs> I'm not gonna like, name any names or anything, but, like, I think for the most part, we all loved each other. Especially kind of, like, the, you know, the final four or whatever, like, we're all super tight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. What do you guys need to do to win? Oh gosh, you <laughs> Olympians. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Yeah, just try and be ourselves, like we normally do. Like whenever I go and do a challenge, I never have to worry about Pete getting mad at me for screwing up. And so I think that always like gives me confidence, and I'm always never really stressed out because I'm like, oh, Pete's never gonna get mad at me. I'm trying my best. Mm -hmm. yeah. And and what's the best part about being on the Amazing Race Canada? Um, the girls. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs>